Five Shot 2 short game review. Ten years after the events of the first game, you are searching for your lost little sister as a big daddy. There is a bit of a cult thing going on in this one, and it's as a response to the excessive individuality in the first one. The weapons are all new because you are a big daddy, and you do get to use the ones you see the other big daddies use, including the drill. There are new enemy types, and the plasmids are more overcharged both for you and for the enemies. So there's more challenge to it and it really does wind up feeling like you know a battle of titans. There are some great battles in this and the climax is fantastic. There are some nice environments. You look at the ocean from the inside less this time I would say. The game is also quite short with about 10 or 12 hours of gameplay and after that, there isn't much else than multiplayer. There are three difficulty settings, though. Multiplayer has the basic first-person shooter modes. Free-for-all, team free-for-all, capture the flag, hold the flag, with a little sister in place of the flag, and domination, where you have to, you know, control control points on the map. In multiplayer, you rise through the ranks as you play more and more and gather more and more atom, and you get access to other weapons, plasmids, and you can use more of them at the time, at one time, it seems.